You being gross? Yes. You being gross? Yes. And you're doing it too. Everyone's doing the thing. Summer. Jeez. <laughs> Summer. It's not that bad, is it? Hands are going to be cold. <laughs> you smell that goat in the doorway. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hands are not going to be cold this time. Summer goat. <laughs> okay, look at the straw. Isn't this great? Summer. <laughs> so I strong today. Why are you so angry? <laughs> not angry, she's just riled. You were riled. Were you, yeah, everyone was thinking thoughts today. Yeah. And they were just hard to deal with. You don't wanna. Yeah. <laughs> So here we are, we're milking goats. And talking about boys. God, don't remind me. Oh wait, there's this boy. Honorable boy. Honorable, <laughs> Honorable mention. mention. Yeah. <laughs> you gonna you gonna help talk about boys too? Yeah, I'm not gonna go talking about boys. Yeah. Okay, so So it's fall, it's usually the breeding season. So everyone's thinking. <laughs> And so they do these little weird things. That get, um, they wag their tail a lot. But yeah, the summer's not in season right now. So. Yeah, she's not thinking about it. Yeah. And so we don't have a buck on because our, our yeah, farm is small. They have a small property, so they have room for a separate area for a boy. Yeah. And they're, they get a little bit, they a lot skink, stinky and can be aggressive. Yeah. We were gonna have Jasper as one. Uh, but and he's absolutely adorable. But and a beautiful gorgeous mm. and gorgeous. He's a pretty boy, but mm, he's a but little feisty. He was a little too aggressive when we first you know, first few days. Days. I mean, come on, he was using my shoe as a headbutt target. Yeah, yeah so. battering. Yeah, he was just, he was teaching your shoe some manners. So. <laughs> what did my shoe do to you? <laughs> it existed and that was enough. So. So every year it becomes this little bit of a circus. You meet up with your neighbors and we say meet hi. Up with the, we meet up with buck owners, and sometimes the local buck is not the right buck. Yeah. Because we had one, and he made pretty babies. We had Ace, is very nice yeah. and sweet, but he had issues with his sweet since birth. Yeah, and then. Uh, all the babies that we got from that particular buck, uh, there was a 50-50 that their yes. legs were going to be. Now, Summer is from that same. Yeah, you were a lucky one. Yeah, you're the lucky one, and then, because your feet are fine. Yes. And sturdy woman. Yeah, it's, you're stamping all around. Attitude, but that's to be expected, is fine. And so, yeah, sometimes the local buck is not the best buck, or like, you know, if that buck's been around, then everyone's related, and that's nope. That's still nope. <laughs> <laughs> right. So, we usually wait until they're thinking about it, and then we load up in the car and on their ride for date night. Yeah. And luckily, uh, buck owners, they kind of know the drills, like, hi, you know, and then... Hi, uh, we're here at a weird hour. Yep, all of a sudden you get a panic text or a panic call, it's like, um... <laughs> so we're hoping to get Nubians. We found a Nubian buck. Right, because we found one. 
Anglo Nubian. Anglo Nubian. Anglo -Nu American Nubian. American Anglo Nubian. Uh, has registered, so it looks yeah. good. We've got um, got to look at him. He has he's black with white spots, and so he's adorable. Hey boy. Gorgeous. Yeah. And he didn't seem overly aggressive, so... Yeah, you seem, you seem like a nice guy. Seem like a nice guy. He, Seriously. Who's causing a ruckus? You know who it is. Yeah. Okay, Sugar. Have we figured this out yet? Have we figured it? Oh, very good. Yay. Very good. <laughs> I heard that. Yeah. Oh, wait, he's just sneezing. Yeah. It's a loud sneeze. Joker. Okay, we figured that part out, but not this part. <laughs> Joker! 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 Oh, there, it's great. No, it isn't. Look how great it is. I know, but you already fed the fed the baby, so is this pointless? Yeah, I saw you. They were snacking like 30 seconds right before. I they, know. they know. They smart. They smart. They old and they smart. And whining. And whining. <laughs> So, All right. Jenny, there we go. Get her. You kind of, when you had your heat, you were a little silent about it. Yeah, it was subtle. Subtle. And they can have silent heats where they don't show any reaction. Yeah. Which is really annoying. Yeah. We got really kind of lucky. The boy that we used with sugar. She, now, she has the same dad as Summer, right? Yeah. Yeah. Right. But then mom. when it was time for her to be bred, we found the golden Guernsey. But cloud. yeah, cloud. And he was pretty, white. He was shorter pretty. than you too. Yeah. And so that's why her babies are the, the short white ones. And annoying. And annoying. <laughs> and everything, but I don't and know. And ate everything. And ate everything because that's what it was. Alright. All right. You. You. And since you also you have a precocious, precocious udder, udder, you're going to be even harder to breed because you're not all that interested. All right. Now, actually having the precocious udder. Oh, man, I need a second jar. Uh, it's okay. Cut the cart. Okay. Don't knock it over. We're good. Okay. Don't knock it over, Thorn Biscuit. <laughs> Swatting already. But she's wagging her tail because she's a little this, bit angry. This is angry, angry wag. Sometimes they wag their tail because they're in season, and sometimes they wag their tail because they're angry. And yeah, sometimes she's they angry right now. Sometimes they wag their tail because they're happy to see their mom and they want something to eat. Or, they, or they're seeing their favorite treat. Sometimes yeah. they get them treats and they wag their tail. Yeah. So, uh, Sugar is Thorny's mom. Yes. And we bred her with, yes, I know, with Cloud, who is a Golden Guernsey. Yes. And so, Thorny is half of a Toggenberg and half of a Golden Guernsey. You're taking after your dad very much, though. Yeah, and so she's shorter. And white. And all white, except for she's golden getting red. a little bit of a golden uh, coat. Hue. Yeah, it seems like she's shedding lots of white fur everywhere. Everywhere. You shed so much, and then you get so fluffy somehow. Yeah, you shake, and then there's just a cloud of white coming off. Is that how they got? Yeah. You don't they also do that when they're mad. They yeah. So we are getting a lot, of course, just maybe like eight ounces, one cup or so, maybe. <laughs> but now, while this one is producing a little bit without having had babies first, her sister um, started out with that, but that has dried up. Eased so off. eased off. And so we're milking her sister less. Now that means that this one, it'll be difficult to breed because the hormones are in imbalance. Yeah. Whereas her sister will probably go into season at the proper age. In a year. Yeah, or a little less Next than a year. year yeah. Probably. Yeah. Don't late. Me. Super late in the year. Yeah. 
because they were born in May, so December-ish, if that. Because we want to make sure that they're strong enough to go through all of the noise. Yeah. It's a pain. Yeah. Yeah, that bandering's not working. Yeah. Neither did the sitting. Yeah. But the thing, the good part is, is that they're getting used to the milk stand. And early. Yeah, early. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah. It yeah. is annoying to have to multiply. Oh, yeah. Because you move around so much. Yeah. But that's good, though. And so that's so that. Yeah. Tiniest piece. Yeah. Missing it. <laughs> I'm missing it and getting it everywhere. All right. So the the one that was Sugar's dad. Sugar's dad. Yeah. We um, the lady who owned him said that he died, so we don't have access to a nice registered Toggenberg box. So, but. Well, that and he would have been related to everyone, so we wouldn't have wanted him specifically anyway. Anyway, right. Everyone's dad. Yeah, so we don't want to. Yeah. So. <laughs> reach you and then right. now you move forward. Yeah. Is none of it helping, is it? Oh. It helps a little. You were pretty full. Cool. That has been a little stressful. Yeah. You did really good at art walk, though. Yes. You're we took you the baby. Art walking. Yeah. The Walk gallery. around downtown and the nice artist. Yes. Uh, uh, Jill. Jill McVarish. Okay. Yeah. yeah. She did a painting of you. Did a painting of you, and everyone was so surprised. They thought, oh, she just made it up. And no, yeah, here's the goat. The, goat. the goat with one horn. Photo here Yeah. Oh. <laughs> now I have to do the other side. Oh, wow. <laughs> Still going. <laughs> yep, I was, I was on one side. Ooh, I heard a ping. Was that the buck owner for texting? Yeah, actually, yeah, I heard a text noise, and that was the Nubian buck owner yeah. saying, hey, come on down. So that's good. They're home, and yeah, we they have, have time for this noise. Nublet, <laughs> I think, and Boo Boo. Maybe in heat. Yeah, so since we don't have a buck on premises, yeah. we no have to load up whoever we think and then yeah. drive over to their property. But, and you, but sometimes uh, they don't go into heat naturally because the weather could be off or something. Yeah. And so what we do then is we get a buck rag. And then what that is, is we take a cloth and rub it all over the boy. The boy. Um, it is male. Yeah, and that is the most horrible. The it strong. does not wash off of clothes until like Ugh. the third wash. It isn't, you it's need bad. so much soap to get it off your hands. Yeah. And even then, those, they were still smelling my hand afterwards. Yeah. And so. It's like rancid ish. Yeah, and then this that's the. the and you have to be careful with it because if, if it gets in the middle, go oh gosh. Yeah, that's even worse. Yeah, that's why you really want to have all of your bucks separated uh, from where your milk does are because. One, if, you don't if want you it in the milk, and two, you don't want um, people Un that shouldn't be bred to be bred. Yeah, and then that way you know absolutely what day. Uh, your babies are expected as opposed to like, hey, look at that. There's a kid in the yard. You know? <laughs> yeah, your sister's trying to talk to you. Yeah. Is she laughing at you? Is no, no, she no, laughing at you? It's funny is when uh, we first got the buck rag uh, around and let them smell it and rubbed it on them a little bit, the one that we didn't want to breed was the first one to go to heat. <laughs> Miss okay. Jelly is Jelly cool. Belly. She is old. She is retired, but she knows the drill, and she smells that smell as a yeah. pheromone. And Jelly, when she goes in the heat, she just becomes twice as obnoxious as she usually is. Like, she'll right. come up and smell your ear. Yeah, and just, yeah. Smell you. Yeah. So and the, she smells people all the time, but, like, worse when she's in heat. Yeah. 
But just... then after he ended, she clicked over and started giving more milk. So that's the good part is if you're going to milk through for two or three years, um, Cocoa Puff gave her five. Hey. Oh, here and we like go. The, the hey! Hurt. You make my thumbs hurt. It's okay. If you're going to milk through, try to use the book rack anyway to get them thinking about it because it'll help them click over. Look. I give more. Yay! Monkey. 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 You've been extra wild today. I know you're looking at that goat over there in the window. Reflection. Okay. Monkey. You're on the way in. It's okay, Monkey Lashes. Okay. Oh my goodness, Monkey. All right, so we're running around outside. We were running around outside earlier. And so I think we got some pictures of. They don't have. Um, so the the smell that the male goat gives off is the pheromone that encourages them to go into season. Which I'm sure if you're a girl goat it smells great, but. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you don't like it either. Yeah, so gross. And when they smell it, they'll do this thing that where they put their lip up. Yeah. So they don't have front teeth. Um, they just have a sensory plate. Hi. <laughs> You're giving me that big eyeball face. Don't even. Don't don't touch my, don't touch don't my touch nose. My face. Okay, I won't do it. Stop. I won't okay. do it. Immediately reaches over. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Right. So they don't have upper teeth like we do. Right. What they have is a sensory plate, and so when they turn their upper lip back, uh, that exposes that sensory plate, and then they can sense the uh, smell of that pheromone better. Yeah. And so there's like. And sometimes when they're really gross, they will do that after smelling each other's pee. Oh. Uh, <laughs> so gross. Those are gross. Yeah. Weird. So, um, yeah, everyone's. They also do that when someone's pregnant, too. Yeah. That's and also kind of like a low key indicator of if there's a boy potentially because they notice they do that more if there's a boy. Yeah. If the. Wait, 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 wait. If, <laughs> yes. What? Hey. I'm trying. I'm trying. Why are you so high strung? All right. Why are you so railed? Wonky. But anyway, smelling that, even though we, we're not gonna, uh, we're not planning to breed Wonky. You already had Jasper and he's alone. Yeah, that, that's fine. <laughs> but she still go, she gives a fair amount, and yeah. so you can. Just, we're planning just, on milking her through. Yeah. And then she was also had the dad who had a fifty percent chance of the knees. Yeah. And so, so you had a different mom. Yeah. And then we bred your specials, baby. Yeah. Special problem. Yeah, your special problem. A good special problem. But then what we did with you is we since you were related to everyone's dad, uh, we went driving three hours one way to see um, another Tog and Bird Tog and Brewery. Yeah, and that's how we got Jasper. Yeah. All right. And I was spilling the milk in the So that was a dedicated thing if you drive three hours so, one way. Yes. <laughs> to get to the boys. <laughs> yes. And then we got that. We got Jasper. He's gorgeous. He's gorgeous. Pretty. And silly. Actually, your dad was short. Yeah. He was taller than your dad and your mom. You were massive. Uh, yeah. Now, move your mask with this. Jelly. <laughs> jelly. Jelly, jelly. Jelly. Jelly, jelly, jelly. Jelly. <laughs> nope. Jelly. You know. Know. More. Always need more. Scared the growl. I'll go, baby. You know the drill. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Go that way. Go that way. Oh, 
What the heck? Did you your horn? Don't even start. Okay, let me... Okay. Jelly? I, I know. Head. It's jelly time. Yeah. Why are you eating straw? It's there. There we go. Okay. And to sort that mess. Yeah. And so, the day after... We brought it back, Craig. You were in full obnoxious heat. So that's how that work. That's supposed to work. Yeah. <laughs> so here we are, like uh, several days later. Yes. Um, the Nubians are thinking maybe. They're thinking about it. Yeah. But also, uh, Jelly. let's see. Jelly's had a variety of. Oh yes. Let's see. She had this thing for a while, where she just had two boys. Two, two, boys, boys, two, boys, two boys, two boys, two boys. Didn't boys. matter who the dad it's was. It's impossible to get a girl out of her. Her first baby, however, was a girl, though. That's how we got Coco Puff. That was Coco Puff. And Coco Puff she was She is good. part Nigerian. So, yeah, so she it was a Nigerian like the, dwarf. Like the short and squat babies, except not. Yeah, it's a, Ni yeah, it's a Nigerian. Nigerian in a tog suit. <laughs> yeah, she has Nigerian, like, face structure. And, and so body like type. Jelly. But the same coloration as a tog. So... <laughs> so you never know when you're gonna cross what you're gonna get. I know. And she then didn't cross because like she had babies finally. Yeah. She was, yeah. Oh yeah. When we bred Puff to a pick me, she did not weird. like her date. Yeah. One bit. She no. butted him across the pen. Yeah, that didn't work. She didn't like him. So, but anyways. Um, so that cross didn't work real well because the baby was not viable, but we were managed we did manage to milk Coco Puff for five years straight. And she did pretty good milk. She was yeah, she was good. She got nine percent butter fat when she was on test. That was yeah. pretty good. Woo, jelly. Yep. You okay? Oh, this old lady's falling down, I know. Yeah. And then I think you had one. With so that was the first we we did two. Yeah. The other babies that she had with a Nigerian, we had two, two boys. boys. One was pure white, and then the other looked just like jelly. Yeah, that was pretty good. And then waddles. And both had waddles. And then, let's see, and then we started driving the three hours, hours. one way <laughs> and I think to we the show goat. Met, what was his name? Elvis? Stormwatch. Stormwatch. Was, his nickname was Elvis because he had a lot of. He had a big, long, shaggy beard. Oh, uh, yeah. He was yeah. a goofy boy. Yeah. He was a good boy. He was a good boy. Yeah. He was... he was like the stinkiest bug we've ever encountered. I don't yeah. know what was going on with him. And then... and Because you would smell for days after that. Yeah. And then we won't talk about the dark times where there was a... Uh, we we crossbred with the boar goat. Oh, yeah. That was weird. We got the little half sea pixie ears. Those were kind of... The that was kind of cool. Also dumb. But that's what the D. I know. I know. It's oddly like they were a little slow. Yeah, but that's I don't know. Maybe it was just them. <laughs> it was just them. I know, Dally Belly. And then. And then we bred you with uh, everyone. Everyone's dad for, <laughs> for a few years. And then somehow I think we got. We got we got Summer, Summer, and Misha out Misha. of out of that, and those are those are deer beasts. They yes, are deer those beasts. Were, yeah. Yeah. Well, it, well, no, because you had Summer and Solstice, so you still had one boy. Yeah. That was but really it was good. The, so weird because you finally had another girl. Yay! So those were keepers. Kept all your girls, all three of them. Yes. <laughs> out of sixteen children, we kept three. <laughs> That's a good jelly. Yeah, you have a lot of babies. Yeah, you get tired. But now that you're 11, we're you're gonna be retired. You're gonna be a lawn ornament. Yeah, you're a lawn Age ornament. Standing lawn ornament. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's still the end. <laughs> yeah. And bed treats and stuff. Yeah. And telling the babies what for. Civilize you them. Don't, you don't like other goats' babies. You're a baby butter. Yeah, you grab their tails and fling them. But then they learn. Yes. 
Okay. All right. Come on, Nibblet. Hi, Nibblet. Nibblet. Oh, now you're not wagging. Need to be embarrassed. We're all girls here. Yeah. And Jasper. And Jasper. Nice. <laughs> all right, new play. Yeah. Is that a play date? Yeah. We're so we have a in case things go south. Yeah. So we open. So the good part is that even the goats that we aren't going to breed this year. They get a whiff of the pheromone or all the girls' pheromones. Yeah. Then, even though they their milk totals had been going down a little bit, they perk up. They perk back up again because it rejuvenates their um, milk-producing hormones a little bit. And it helps their like natural clock too, because yeah. sometimes the weather will not be fall-like and they'll be. Very confused, not growing their winter coats. Yeah. Since we have some some warm warm autumns, and then that puts their season later and later and later in the year. <laughs> the latest we ever gotten was jelly, of course. Yeah. We we got her in January. Yeah, and so that's how we got summer and solstice. <laughs> oh, so late. <laughs> so late. So yeah, we always like to try to get. September, October, November. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. So we have three Nubians. So yeah. this is the Boo Boo, Tootsie, and uh, And Nooblet. Her name's Ariel, but she doesn't answer to it. Yeah. She answers to Nooblet. Nooblet. And you're a little bit short for a Nubian, so that's why you're a Nooblet. It's okay, though. Right. Because your date is short. Fine. You've been going pretty good for two years here, so. Yeah. Two year lactation. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, hop, in the car. hop in the car and go see what happens. And then if that doesn't work, we'll be back in the next month. Yeah. And then your collar is amazing. There you go. There you go. And we still have our book jar. Smell it. Smell it. We're waiting till after milking to smell it though. Yeah. <laughs> Nope, I feel like a bird. Nope.